Hello again, welcome back to Subnautica on the Nintendo Switch. So I did a couple of things offline because I completely failed last time and ended up destroying my um, seam off. So I built a prawn suit, travelled around and did a few bits. So what I basically did, I've got a couple of resources, I have built a new seam off, I went back down to that area with the Degassi base, where I died and lost everything and picked everything up. So I now have the items that I was missing. And I've also upgraded this and got myself a computer chip for this. So what happens with the computer chip is you put it in your head. And I accidentally pressed the wrong button because I'm so used to the PS5. And when you search for things, it will come up here. So let's look for what should I put? Fragment. So when we do this, it'll show it on the HUD there, so you can see it on the map. But then when I walk around, it'll be displayed. So that's kind of cool. So I've got that. I've also, I can't remember if I did this the last episode or I did it outside. I built another one of those because I was running out of power. Because sometimes it just seems to go really, 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 really quickly. I'm not sure why. So I'm going to put other stuff in it. But sometimes it seems to last ages, and sometimes it seems to last no time at all. Which is very, very strange, because it used to work quite well. Can I see? Hmm. My inventory's full. I need to... Um, see my inventory, I forgot those are so big. Okay. Right, let's put some stuff away. Get in. I can't let in. I go there. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got a message as well, which I haven't listened to. Play partially translated broadcast. That's me. So that's the security guys, the warpers going around clearing the planet. So, yeah. That's who they're after, is me. Right. Let's sort out my inventory back to what it should be, because I've put loads of crap in this, and this should be... Oops, wrong ones. This should just be titanium. I keep pressing my button. Do the quartz out of there. Put metals. <laughs> organic, anything organic. I need to take a whole away. Oh, on button. That one, that one, and that one. The organic. Blocker can get quartz in it. That's it. Let's put some. Food and water away. Or some water anyway. That'll do oh, I should probably drink. Yep, one button. I didn't mean to capture. There's too many buttons for capture. Should really eat as well. Right, let's go get some food in a minute. So one thing I don't have a lot of on my base is food. I do have those um potato plants I could eat, I guess. I keep forgetting about those. But I'd rather save those for when I really need them. I'm going to have a peep quickly. Peep, 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 peep. Nope, doesn't want me to have a peep, so I'll just make do with that. <laughs> to cook boomerangs. What I do need to do is find that place I went previously and almost lost my prawn suit. I need to go there and see if I can find more parts of the prawn suit and stuff. So, now oh, there's only one. 
Because I can't make water while I'm out, but I can get food easy. Yes, Imor! Remember... Right, i got to fix it, because it's always getting pushed into things. Because you know that's kind of what I do in it. Repair! 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 I'm letting go 900 again, so I've fully upgraded it again. Is it southwest or northeast? I can never remember. Let's go this way and see what happens. I'm not heading towards that because I did that last time and I don't need to go back there right now. I did get the cuttlefish as well. So I've got an aquarium I can build. So at some point I shall build an aquarium and get a cuttlefish because they're cool. They're cute and nice, so I shall get one next time. At the moment, I want to find that fragment of the ship, because I didn't explore it. Have I got everything on me? Yeah, I have. Good. I'm actually heading for that. Wait a minute. It wasn't far away from the island, wasn't it? With us in the prawn soup, so I had to go the other way. Well, I kind of went around, didn't I? The island. The main island. Whoa, I got some air then. Did I not fix? I thought I fixed my boat just now. What the hell? Not the island I thought I was going to. Sworn I repaired it fully. But I didn't actually want to head for this. It must have been north. Alright, let's head back then. Because I don't need to be here. So I don't think I need to be. As far as I remember, it was the other island I went towards. But we'll have a look around, because you never know what I've missed. I do need to extend the range on my um, scanner room. It's not the best at the moment. But I don't know how useful it'll actually be. I don't need my light on, really, do I? few bits and pieces around. I'm sure I know what that is. Did I scan that already? Can't remember if I scanned one of those. I'm going to get hurt now, aren't I? Yeah, I did scan one of those. Let's get out of here. I don't really need much ruby and stuff at the moment. Oh, for God's sake. I've got to learn to drive this damn thing. I really, really do. I'm always hitting something. I'm at 77 already because I haven't got the extra armor on it, have I? I had last time and I still got destroyed straight away. I'm not taking any chances. Well, not too many chances. I'm going to take some chances, otherwise it's going to be boring, isn't it? Well, if that's behind me... Yeah, I think I'm going to head this way. I just want to find a few more... Like, pieces of the Aurora. So I'm sure there's things I've missed. Oh, I think I've had one of these pieces. Yeah, I've been here. And I've crashed into the ground. Oh, I've done that one. I 
Let's go this way. What was there? That's what I need to do. I'm gonna get that beacon, find out what it was I put it I put it by a a ship piece, I'm sure I did. I'm sure I put it by a piece of the Aurora. As far as I remember. Let me turn the volume up because this one's quiet. And there's not that many noises. And it's a lot quieter than some other games I play, so. We need to have some of the noises and music and speech and freaky creatures making odd noises. Eight, five. God's sake. It's a make funny noises, those sea cows. Poisonous sea cows as well, you see. But those little poison things that they throw out of their tail when they don't like you. And so look what this beacon actually is, and I might be able to collect it and put it somewhere else. I honestly do not know what it's displaying. Oh, this one. I think I did all of this one. If so, I can get rid of the beacon then, can't I? There's loads of Seamoth fragments here. Kind of annoying. Right, I did. Let me just double check that I did finish this one. Pretty sure I did. No, I didn't. Okay. That was annoying. I can't open that door. Oh. Picture frame. Nice. They had that in in Beyond Zero. They didn't have in this one originally. Is this going to put me in a room I've been in? Oh, that one with the room you can't open. Basic plant pot might be useful. Might be. Oh, I've definitely cut that open. Alright, so I have been here. Just double check, just in case. Freaky noise. That looks like a doorway down there, doesn't it? Okay, let's have a look around just in case. This seems like quite a big thing, but there's not a lot in it. That, that's the one I came out of, I think, then. Yeah, right there. I don't think there's anything on top. Yeah, it seems like I've done that one. Okay, on we go! God, I already need to get us some water. The hell, thirsty boy. 42. Seriously. This 
This looks like a good area. So I know there's often a, there's a couple of locations that the the Aurora pieces can spawn in. Oh, there's another vent. Sometimes they're up high as well. In these like weird tree things. Reef back. I don't know why I put that there ages ago. That's like one of the first things I did, wasn't it? Was it because there was... I think it was because I couldn't explore it because there was nuclear fallout. You know what? I'm going to collect that. Where'd it go? Land's right on top of it. No! Welcome aboard, okay. Captain. I'm gonna have a scan around first. So I've obviously not done this one, I don't think. I've got that. Maybe I have done this one. Ah! Shop. Let's have a quick look around. No, oh, can't even go in there. I thought I'd be getting through the top, to be honest. Put a little big electric eel thing. Does it feel like this will lead somewhere? Probably won't mind. This is a very, very, very dangerous thing to do. Yeah, this is a silly place to go, because I don't know. Oh, shoot. Yeah, let's not stay in here, shall we? It's the wrong way. Oh, shoot. This was a really bad idea. There it is. There it is. Salvation. That was a stupid thing to do. Right, that does not look like there's a way, but there has got to be a way in. That does look like a way, doesn't it? And it is, because I'm stupid. Right. Yeah, come on, doing this. Oh, 
that's the way to get the grow bed. Nice. Ooh. Ooh, reinforced dive suit. That'd be good, right? So that's a good thing, but I need to get out now because I don't know how long this is going to take me. Because it's quite a long way out. And I don't have the really, really good equipment yet. Oh, shoot. Right. Let's go that way. And go back in and so go straight. Right, that's good. I got the dive suit. It's not necessarily the one I wanted, but a reinforced dive suit is better than nothing, definitely. That'd be quite good for later on. Alright. Open sesame seed. Well. Ready, let's get it ready. I should have done all ready, shouldn't I? Go on, give me some of good. Give me some of good. This is just gonna take forever now. Ah! Nine ten oxygen left. I really need to get that better oxygen. I've got a sonar upgrade. Integrating new PDA data. That'd be useful. I've already got it though. There's anything else to say? No, I think that is it for this this piece. On we go. Fluid intake, luckily. I bought lots of fluid with me. Alright, that's good. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay, I think we've got to explore a little bit now. I'm a 93% health on my seam off. As long as I don't keep crashing into things, I should be fine. Let's have a look. But that's good, but now I've at least got a beacon I can use, so that's good. I know I could have built one at any time, but I always forget about beacons. It's like the Pathfinder tool. I keep saying, I'm going to get that. That'll be really useful. And then I forget about it and don't use it. Oh, uh, not comfy. It's a bit comfy, right? Really? And something bashes into me. I got the repulsion. I've got the propulsion as well. Okay. I've got that. I have a feeling this isn't going to be a very nice area to be, so I'm going to turn my light off for a minute. Just because. It's not that deep, though. Well, I say that, and then it just drops off suddenly. Well, there's loads of... Things that get. Right, there are creatures here, so this isn't the dead zone yet. Don't like the sound of that. No, this looks like the dead zone. I 
that very much. That is the dead zone. Right. Let's not go there again. Ghost Leviathans live in the dead zone and they will just kill you. So yeah, we're not going there. Let's go this way. Let's try and remember where everything is. I used to know the map quite well. But it's been quite a while since I played the first game. Probably no below zero better at the moment than this one. But there's certain things that go, I remember that. I remember. Alright. Oh my god, leave me alone. Get somewhere safe a minute and then get out. That's not safe, there's an electric eel. Let's go down here. Not safe. Sharks. Another electric eel. God's sake. More sharks. And random fish. Oh shoot. Aboard, There's a lot of noise around me. A lot of noise I don't like. Including these guys who are gonna try and shock me. But let's go. Oh. Mission fragment. Right, so I guess we're gonna stay around here for a minute. Have a look for more fragments. No, that doesn't look friendly. Let's stick this way a little bit more. I'm worried about going too far north now because that does lead to the dead zone that we just discovered a minute ago. See, if I had a scanner room around here, I could scan for parts. Eighty-five percent again. That's a warper. So what am I now then? Hmm. Am I near the other island then? I think I'm getting near the edge of the world again. No, I say the edge of the world, I mean like the edge of the playable area. Because they didn't want to just put a wall, so they put the dead zone. Ah, there's another warper. And it's not warning me of the dead zone anymore after I went in the first time and saying, go ahead, you know where it is, stay away! And I can't. Oh, yeah. Is this the dead zone? This bit isn't. Actually, it could be. I'm going to head back in towards the centre of things now. I can't remember where the sea treaders are. Where are the sea treaders? Oh! Reaper Leviathan, don't want to be killed, and have a Reaper Leviathan. Alright, let's go this way. This is not a good place. Kind of think I might know where I am, but I'm not even sure. Ah ha ha! What is this? I ask myself. This is another broken part of the ship. 
I don't think I've been to before. Oh, yes. There's a door I can break, so let's have a look and break it. And this is the bit that takes forever. I'm going to open this, go back to the seam off, turn the lights on, so I can instantly see where I am a lot easier. I need to eat as well. I'll be okay for a minute. Back up, let's go. Ocean arms. I'd rather a grapple arm to be honest, but you know. New blueprint acquired. Please observe safety protocol CSP twenty one before handling classified cargo. Ooh. Oh, I thought there's something more interesting. In. Although, you know, that's pretty good. Who was this? What's this? Cyclops thermal reactor. New blueprint acquired. Quilted double bed. Oh, and a shelf unit. That'd be cool. Already got the shelf unit. New blueprint acquired. Oh, single wall shelf. Let's have that as well then while we are shall we? Alright, then we head out and then see what else we can do. Got all that. New blueprint acquired. So I'm sure there should be something else here. There's a box there. Neutral green bar, as it were. Alright. Let's have a pizza bite. And a drink. No, have a look around the rest of it. So I have a feeling that can't just be the only way in. It looks like there should be a way in on this side as well. Ah. No, that's a way out. What's that? Reactor. I don't have that, do I? So I could use that. If I really wanted to. Well, that's cool. I got the nuclear reactor as well. Stupid things biting me. Seriously, man. Got it now, so. Ooh, 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 ooh! Crap, on fragment! Come on, let it be the only one I need. One of two. Looks like another one. Yes! Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh I can use the prawn suit properly now. Got. Well, this has been quite interesting, hasn't it? Quite very interesting. Right, so this is where the grappling arm is then. Some gold. And even more nuclear reactor stuff. Let's get back and see more from the ground. There's grapple arm right in front of me as well. Another one over there. There's enough grapple arm fragments here, I think. Is there ever enough grapple arm fragments? I ask myself, though. You know. Is there ever enough grappling arms? No, there are. More grapple arms, that's what we want. When do we want it? No! Um, I guess I'll go in that way. At least try. Right, pop 
potion. I've already got it, so that's fine. A chic plant art. Oh yes, water filtration suit! That's even better than the other suit. Alright, so this has been fairly successful then. Don't think there's much else here. No, there doesn't seem to be anything else here. As far as I can tell. Alright, let's head out then. Head out and see if we can find a way. Now I want that water filtration too. It's cool. And also kind of funny. What happens when you equip it. But I shall not spoil it. I shall wait till... I actually do it. So we're going in case there's another entrance. Don't think there's going to be. Yeah, so I went in before. I haven't really been on the other side much though, have I? Door there. Is that the door I couldn't access from the other side? I'm guessing. Yeah, I think that's it. Well, that was excellent timing. Right, so all I need now is a couple of pieces for the Cyclops, and I'm kind of set. Suit. Extreme temperatures will be useful later, and the water filtration will be great because it will just give me endless supply of water. So I'm quite happy with that. And I've got the potion cannon, all of these, and the, all the stuff for the prawn suit. Sim charge fins I shall make as well. I want the ultra high capacity, that's so many things. And all the Cyclops depth modules. Oh, I just need two more. Two more hull blueprints. Got the fire suppression. I've got everything else. Oh, I'm so happy. Nuclear reactor, any containment. All the different plant pots. New bed. Picture frames. All shelves. I basically have pretty much everything there is to get now. Apart from the Cyclops. I just need the two two pieces for Cyclops. To me may have to go to the sea treaders. I probably have to go to the sea treaders because I've not been there at all in this playthrough. But I'm going to have to remember where it is. I may have to actually look at a map. I don't want to do that, but I kind of just want to get it done as well, you know. I can't remember the life of me where the sea treaders live. And I like the sea treaders. They're cool. Uh, that looks too extreme, Jock, doesn't it? Let's not do that. I can hear Reapers, I'm sure that's a Reaper. I don't like where I am. I'm not very low down, but it feels like an abyss below me, doesn't it? Doesn't feel great. Oh, I'm here again. Okay, so I'm here, so... Where is that other ship part? Because I came here by mistake, didn't I? When I was... I was... Doing the... Salvage operation. And I messed up a little bit. Coming back. Which way I was... There it is! Is that it? Yay! Or was that the one I just did? 
So that's what I just that's the one I just did. Damn. Because there was another one. Must have been the other way. Hmm, frustrating. I haven't got much power. I've only got 62. Oh, shoot. Leave me alone. That thing's all it means, so is that one. Shh. How does that go down? Oh, maybe not. I don't leave me alone. Why is it here? I'm to actually save it just in case. One button. I am actually going to save it because I'm a coward. Wrong button. Wrong button. Save. Yeah, that's got to be a no, no go zone. Well, I didn't like the way it lagged then. Leave me alone! That sounds like a lot of nasty things around me, doesn't it? I can't remember where it was, but I was in the prawn suit. Oh, that's annoying, isn't it, that I forget? I'm going to have to look back in my footage and see how I got there. It's definitely not this way. I don't think it's this way. Let's have a look, shall we? This is okay by here because there's a floor. That's 76%. Right, there's a lot of volcanoes here. Up, there's a lot of sharky sharks. Hmm. Can't remember what it was near. Was it near the? Oh, was this near? I'm near the island again. Maybe it was around here. I honestly cannot remember. Maybe I need to have a little bit of an explore. While I'm out here, yeah, I'll just be careful not to use too much fuel so that I can actually get back. And I need to fix my seam off before somebody destroys it. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Da. There are a lot of lot of volcanoes. I didn't realise there were so many volcanoes. I must admit. Hmm. 
Very frustrating. It's the only trouble with games like this when you don't have an actual map. I know there are maps available, I mean an in-game map. Quite useful sometimes having a map. But a lot of the times you know exactly where to go. Although I'm not always good with a map, it doesn't show you where you are, I get lost. Because I'm good with real maps, but in-game maps are sometimes a bit hit and miss for me. Because they, I find a lot of games, like Minds of Moria, where they give you a map, but it's not actually representative of what the place is, so it gets a little bit confusing. Leave me alone, shark! Oh, shoot. Get out of dodge! Welcome aboard, Captain. I'm just gonna head back to base, I think. So I only got 51% left on my electricity. And I've got quite a lot of nice new equipment, so. And I'll keep going around this kind of area while I'm here, just in case I see anything. I cannot for the life of me remember where that part of the ship was, though. Couldn't have been too far away from here. I know, home's over there. I just want to have a quick look around. I don't explore much of this. Sure, it must have been near the mushroom forest then. Was it lying on the mushrooms? Or was it just on a piece of rock? Honestly, can't remember. Yeah, all I'm doing is getting into worse trouble and worse trouble, aren't I? Yeah, okay. Let's go home. Let's go home! I've accomplished quite a lot and I've got a lot of items, so I've got a lot of things to build to help me on the way. It's just I've got to remember the sea treaders are. Because that's where I'll find the last parts, I think. It's the only place I've not been yet, so that's got to be where the parts are for the Cyclops. It's a big crater, isn't it? I didn't realize sharks weren't so near the surface, these sharks anyway. Well, they're much deeper sharks than that. Strange, strange! Must have done quite a big chunk of the map though. So I'm now heading south again. How far away am I? I'm not far away now. Good, good. Yeah, tell me where the fragments are, but they're too close to home. Build some stuff on the filtration suit because that is wickedly good. It's possibly one of the most useful items, but the reinforced suit is going to come in useful a little bit later, definitely. Welcome aboard, Captain. Alright, what do I need? I need to also build the better um, reaver as well. Alright, so the only thing is I need to be one of those and one of those that should be fine. I hopefully got enough lithium. Grappling arm, benzene, I hope I can make. I need more silver though. Right. 
Able gel, synthetic fiber, copper wire. That's what I need. Synthetic fiber. Benzene. I've got blood oil. Good. All right, I'll make some benzene, so let's do that. Pin. 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 All right, so I need copper wire as well. All right, let's do that. Excellent. I won't have to worry about water anymore. I will turn that off because that's going to get really annoying. Um, I'm going to need three. Do that first. That now I need one of those which I should have by there. I need one, let's not be greedy. And a ruby 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 ruby. It's only one? Yeah. I need some fiber mesh. Look, I got cuttlefish. I've already got an air drop. Nice. Oh, I did need to make one of those. Right, so I do need copper, copper wire, and fiber mesh. Right, so I don't have any. I do. But, but let me, I don't think I can take it back out, can I? Oh, it's actually gone from there anyway, so I need to get a few more. Alright. Way, let's dump some of this crap. I don't need a minute. I just don't need that. I don't need that. Don't need the titanium at the moment. Any gold, I put that in there. I will need to get some more silver at some point, though. I do know that. All right, let's go get what we need then. All right, so what I need is some fiber mesh, which I make from these plants. I did think about planting some of these by my base, but then I thought, that's the point. Just seems like hard work. And they're annoying because they grow too fast, too tall. I'm getting in the way. No, I'll do it this way. I'm going to make it first. And then fuel up my generator. I'll do that first. All right. Matt, and then some copper wire, and that's my suit done. <laughs> Rack to rod. I can do that as well. Yeah, need to do that in the upgrade station. Right, that should last a little bit. Oh, maybe it is just a normal fabricator then. Oh, it is a normal fabricator. Ho 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 ho! Oh, I love this bit. This is funny. Water filtration suit equipped and capturing body moisture. To chemically neutralize residual odors, press the activation button in the next three seconds. And there's no activation button. You have chosen not to activate chemical taste neutralization. Thank you and have a nice day. So it means all the recycled water, so that sweat and urine, will taste like sweat and urine. How nice is that? Right, wait, it automatically puts it on. It's moisture from the body and provides clean drinkable water. 
Oh, that's so cool. Get rid of my radiation suit because I no longer need it at all. Yay! Getting somewhere. Right. Get all that. So what do I need for my pony stuff? I need... Oh, God. So... Ah, I'm bad again! So I need that. That would be good. I need nickel. That would be good by polyaniline. That would be good. Good. That would be good, but I need kyanite and polyaniline. Nickel. I'm not worried about that yet. Peter one is annoying. All right, so I need a plastic lingot and four lithium. Do I have a lithium? Not there. Let me let me get all the metal out of there. Magnetite can stay there for now, I guess. I've only got one diamond. Water. I don't have lithium again. Damn it! Run out of lithium. Oh, and I got loads of titanium. Right, okay, so it's lithium I need to get. What I can do. Wrong way, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. Stop scanning, stop scanning, stop scanning. Oh, what's that? Oh, hey. Hey, hello there. Sorry about that. I only just noticed you were there. But I got so engrossed in the game. Yeah, I got the mic on. So, let's go. Um, how do you manage to resource inventory effectively in the game? Um, I honestly, I'm not very good at that. People tell me off it all the time because I'm not very, very good. Ooh. See if I can find more wax. What I try and do is try and label everything. So I've got titanium, other metal, so gold, silver, lead, lithium, things like that, food and water, organics or anything, plant life, and things like that. Although I put some radioactive material in there as well, you know. And then it's I've got like glass and rubies and diamonds and stuff like that in there. So let's try and organize it. I need to label them, but I'm very slow at doing that. Um, I think the storyline, because I didn't expect so much from it, something I really enjoy about the game. I like the whole survival aspect and the whole unusual underwater and all the different creatures, but I think it's the storyline is really good. But I think the most surprising thing for me, other than the story being quite as good as it is, is the sound design being so absolutely amazing. The the sound of the creatures, like you can hear everything in the background. They sound like creatures, and some of the sound design for some of the monsters is absolutely amazing. Especially as everyone, Jack Septica and everyone else agrees the same thing that the, the the crab squids have the most amazing sound. They are so bizarre. Scary as hell when you hear that noise. But yeah, I think it's the... Uh, it's that. But uh, that's the most surprising. The fascinating is the whole underwater aspect of it. Because there's nothing else like it. You know, I play a lot of survival games. The forest and green hell. And you're always on an island somewhere. And, and stuff like that. Or, or in a jungle. Or in a forest, obviously. But having the whole underwater thing and having to worry about oxygen as well as food and water and you know, electricity and power and all the other things you've got to do, it just makes that a little bit more interesting. Slightly more challenging because everywhere you go you have to worry about how long you're staying out of your like boats and stuff. Ah, thank you. It's... I do love this game. I have played it several times. This is my fourth or fifth playthrough. I'm playing it currently on Nintendo Switch. I played it first on PC Early Access and then played the full version. I played it on PS4, PS5, Xbox, and now on this. 
Um, other games I stream is No Man's Sky at the moment because there was a new expedition came out a couple of weeks ago and when you complete it you get a special ship which is kind of like the Razor Crest from the first couple of seasons of The Mandalorian. Well, first season of Mandalorian. When did it get destroyed? But yeah, it's very similar to that ship, so that's really cool. And at the moment, I also stream a lot of Destiny 2. Destiny 2 is really good. How about yourself? What sort of stuff do you play? Or do you just tend to watch others play? Which I happen to do a lot as well. I do have Discord, but I don't use it much, to be honest, because I tend to do a lot more YouTube than Twitch. Twitch is something I've only kind of got into more recently. Because I've been doing YouTube for probably six years or something. Oh, last was two. Ah, cool. Yeah, CSGO and stuff. PUBG is okay. Something I really, really, really didn't get into though is Fortnite. I just can't get on with the building stuff. I am hoping when, because I've got, obviously, as I said, I've got an Xbox, I've got Game Pass and so on, because that's the cheapest way to do it. But in October, I think, the next Call of Duty is going straight onto it, so that would be cool. Yeah, cool. I said, I don't use it very often yet because I don't have many followers. I've got more people watching me on YouTube. I've got about, I think, just over 4,000 subs on YouTube at the moment. So I'm trying to build... Well, so what I'm trying to do at the moment is build up my Twitch. And what I used to do was just record videos for YouTube and that was it. But now I'm streaming on Twitch and then converting those to videos for YouTube as well. And doing the old like, unboxing video and all that sort of thing on YouTube as well to try and kind of... Kill two birds with one stone. So yeah, when I got mo, I shall send you. I'll keep your username and I'll send you my Discord. Not a problem. But I I tend to do. Mm, there's a few multiplayer games I play with like my son and a couple of friends and that sort of thing as well. Yeah, no problem. I can do that. Yeah, something I also do as well. Usually around Halloween or somewhere around there, I tend to do a 24-hour live stream for charity. Usually it's for, like, cancer charities, that sort of thing. I think I've done it six years in a row now. But unfortunately, one of my friends that me and a few others game with, and he used to take part in that, lost his battle with cancer, like, a couple of months ago. So we're actually going to do one for him this year, which is it's kind of sad, but... It's a nice thing to be able to do because he, he would have he would have liked that because obviously I said it was, it was a big part of this channel. Well, oh, mainly my YouTube channel, like because I said I didn't really do a lot on Twitch until recently. Yeah, he was a, he was a big gamer. We played a lot of Destiny 2 together. We played like the entirety of Destiny 2 for a long time. And the forest we played, Red Dead Redemption, and... It's something we did a lot of. It was actually met in first year in lockdown. And a bunch of us were playing like GTA. And he joined us on Red Dead after we'd been playing it a bit. And we all hit it off. He, he already knew the other people I played the games with. So he kind of joined up and hit it off. And he was just so funny. So much fun. So we did a lot of Red Dead. We completed all of... Yeah. We completed all of like Red Dead multiplayer. And... We did a lot as well then with GTA 5 and completed all of the multiplayer stuff you can and did all the heists. What we did actually last year, said for a charity event, he joined me as well. It was me, him, friend Josh and my son Jack. We we did 24 hour live stream for, I said, for cancer charities, but we played GTA. We all created brand new characters and tried to see how far we could go and see if we could get up to the diamond heist all in one out in one like night we didn't manage to but then we did a couple of uh like sessions after that which i still have about 60 gig of footage to go through that he's on as well so it's like so much to go through it's the only trouble when you're like playing long games like that is you get a lot of footage and it takes forever and i don't have the best computer in the world so 60 gig of footage takes a long time to go through but i'm getting there there's only a few more to do so it's good. I, I enjoyed GTA. I can't wait for the new one. It's one of those things I, I enjoy a lot of the multiplayer, like stuff like Destiny. I play that solo and multiplayer, and it's quite good. It's not bad. It's good fun. 
it's so weird getting used to like chatting because obviously YouTube I tend to just post videos so you just get comments and it's it's always a bit strange getting somebody like chatting away on text it's like I have to keep looking and remembering it's there ah it'll be fine I'll get there it's just a, sometimes a lot with working full time and then trying to stream as well and record videos and edit and do all that and go to the gym and it's just oh, so much yeah, I will do. I'll, I'll keep the chat up when I finish, and I'll I'll send you a message. Not a problem. Right, what do I need to do now? Right, it's lithium I actually need. Did it find any racks? No, I didn't because they're too far away apart. Sandstone. Was it sandstone has lithium? I can never remember which ones have what. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Right, what I think I need to do then is go back to find some more lithium. Although I might call it a night because it's getting late and I've got early start in the morning. So that's what I'm probably going to do is save it. Yep, I'm going to run now. So thanks for joining me. Join me again soon. Please do on my YouTube as well. As it says on the top of the screen is actually called Wars on My Fault. So feel free to go and have a look at the videos. I've probably got about 700 videos on this. So feel free to join me there. Anyway, I'm going to go now. So thanks a lot for watching me and see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.